Hello everyone, I'm Joe Bishop, Bishop Backwood Survival. Today I am smoking mullet. I've had them on for about two hours now. Uh, they're coming along quite well. I've got 12 of these on. I'm going to eat some and then I'm going to also make some uh, mullet dip. This is my firebox. Right now I have oak and uh, Japanese plum, which is a, a loquat. It's a fruit tree. Uh, really good hardwood. I've never used it before, but it seems to be doing good. Uh, most hardwoods and uh, nut woods and fruit woods do really good for smoking, cooking on. And you can see the smoke going up. It's got a little bit of heat to it. Not a lot, but uh, getting a good smoke flavoring in and it heats this box up. I made this uh, smoker out of a uh, uh, aluminum bread bread box. It was, it was open, all you do is slide your racks of bread in it. I got it cheap and uh, made my smoker out of it. Got my heat right underneath it so my heat goes up. I'll leave that door cracked like that so it gets a little bit of air and smoke. This is my, this is my seasoning. A Creole seasoning, but what I really want in it is uh, let's see, where is it? It's got ingredients in there somewhere. It's got salt, red pepper, and black pepper, is what I'm really looking for, but it also has chili powder and garlic powder. Uh, makes a really good flavor on that smoked fish. Mullet's a really oily type of fish and uh, makes a when you smoke it, it brings that oil to the top and makes a really, really good uh, tasting fish when you use the right seasoning for it. Some people will just uh, add just a little bit of salt and a little bit of black pepper to it. And, uh, but this is my preferred method. I think it comes out really good. I like hot stuff anyway. And the dip that I make calls for a little bit of spice for it. So I'm Joe Bishop, Bishop Backwood Survival. I'll show you the fish one more time real quick. Let me see what they look like. This fish still has a backbone in it. You split it down on one side of the backbone and you open him up, take the guts out, cut the head off, split him down, take the guts out, and then season him and put him on there. And here, I Got probably about another two hours before the fish is done, nice and slow cooked. So I'm Joe Bishop, Bishop Backwood Survival, and y'all have a good day.